Kirby in on goal for Chelsea. Kirby with the cross. And there's Nuskin. And there's the opener. And in the end, after all of that hard work, Sunderland out to the left-hand side. Chelsea advance into the area again. It's a good one to see a bit more of on the ball. Because she has got that exquisite technical ability. Amano linking up Kankovic. The delivery comes in and it's gone all the way into the back of the net. Chelsea, two goals up. A real practice of patience for Chelsea and execution and decision making as well. Really going to be important. And supported by Ingle. Chelsea can attack again. Space for Beaver Jones. Chelsea lose possession, but Luskin comes charging back over to try and regain it. And there's Brighton currently leading the other contest against Aston Villa. And Deer does really well. Aggie Beaver Jones doing her defensive duties, and it falls. Kirby to Beaver Jones over on the right hand side. Kirby making a good run into the box as well, and the shot comes in. And right away after the break, Chelsea extend. The ball bounces over, and the shot comes in, blocked by Buchanan. Sunderland in here. Scar crossing the ball in. It's a decent cross, showing that she can defend and be useful with headers in both boxes. Equally so. Amano, right-hand side, but Chelsea played back to Buchanan. Played many, including their Champions League games at Stamford Bridge. Some very memorable games at both grounds. To Hamano. Back to the forward. That's a lovely little cutback. And the move is finished eventually by Frank Kirby. Chelsea's fourth. Poor body language and when they've had chances to break, the visitors have looked bright. Ball comes in for Sunderland. Kankovic finds Hermano. I'm sure her admiration would have grown as the evening unfolded. Unlike the first half, it's Kankovic. Has time. Aggie Beaver Jones, the appetite to get on the ball, which she does. Aggie Beaver Jones in on goal for Chelsea. Really nice turn. Really good shot. Nice turn. Nice layoff. We've been relentless and professional. Perise. Into additional time here. The cross comes in. And the header from Fan Kirby. A five star night for the current champions. And that is the full time whistle. Chelsea progress through to the Continental Cup semi-final.